What's up guys? Today we're going to be discussing goals, challenges, and themes for 2024. One of our main poker goals was to turn 1K into 100K. As of today, we are up about 18K. Um, with about a week left in the quarter. So we're slightly behind on that goal, but we are going to be looking to play a little bit higher as the bankroll builds. One of our other poker goals was to play 2000 hours within the calendar year. This is a goal that we are definitely behind. Um, it's a lot more challenging than I thought it would be. For some of you guys who don't know, besides playing poker, I am obviously doing the YouTube channel, but um, I've been working to get my Airbnb off the ground and also working to get my Turo business off the ground. So it's been really difficult to put in the volume. In order to play 2000 hours in a year, you would need to play about... Alexa, what's 2000 divided by 365? 5.4795. You would need to play about five and a half hours a day. This seems attainable, um, but when you take into consideration you know, getting sick, taking time for yourself and family, as well as studying and focusing on other things as your health and fitness, it can become quite a challenge. Um, one of the things I did not factor in is the amount of time it would take to actually start a YouTube channel. It's been very, very challenging and a great learning experience but that also takes time away. Hopefully we'll still be able to hit it, but if not, it's um, something that we still are proud to shoot for. One of our other poker goals is that we would like to play in 50 different poker rooms throughout the year. I think this is pretty obtainable, especially once we go to Vegas for the World Series. We could probably play in about 12 to 15 rooms while we're there. And when we head to Texas, we can probably hit a few rooms there as well. So one of our goals with our poker winnings is that every single winning month we have, we would like to invest in some type of an asset. Rather that be a purchase of a Turo car, um, an investment in land or property, or even just buying a stock. That's one of the goals that we have so that we're constantly looking to invest outside of poker to generate multiple streams of income. So in January, um, we finished up about 5,500. We purchased the car for Turo, a 2019 Hyundai Sonata. In February, we finished up about 9,500. So a portion of those winnings we set aside for a down payment for our adventure van. The goal is to purchase the adventure van at some point in 2024. So the month of March, we finished up $6,261. $5,000 of this we deposit into a business checking account that will pay us $350 after 60 days of maintaining the balance. This is a 7% return for doing absolutely nothing. We would also like to travel to one international destination at some point in 2024. One of my main goals was to focus on my health and my fitness. The goal was to be active every single day. And I would say that I'm doing a pretty good job at being active, but it hasn't been every single day. It's probably been about four to five times a week. Within being active every day, we want to lose 25 pounds in 2024. So we did a weigh-in on January 1st. We weighed in at 191 pounds. We did our second weigh-in February 1st, where we weighed in at 188 pounds. And we did a third weigh-in where we weighed in at 186 pounds. So our next weigh-in will be coming up in about a week. Let me know what goals and challenges you guys set forth for yourselves at the beginning of 2024 and what you guys are doing to keep on pace and hitting your goals.